Well, all right, all right, all right, and welcome back to Planet Gen X. I'm Sean, and today I want to talk about wrestling. And guys, if you hadn't been watching wrestling lately, you're missing out. For any of you old schoolers like me who've been watching it since you were a little kid, now is the time to be watching WWE again. Yes, Vince McMahon is out, Triple H is in, and this is by far the best it's been in over a decade, no doubt. And uh, one of the main reasons for that is Triple H. He has made so many changes to bring the, the feel of WWE back to that old school, back to that, uh, the, the intricate storylines, uh, which, you know, didn't really show up until the 90s, per se. But um, we kind of got used to stuff like that. And in some of them in the later years have been really, really weak and didn't make any sense, especially if you're watching say, any of the other companies we won't name here today. But, um, yeah, they are bringing strong stories. Uh, and I can give you an example of one of the latest on last night's SmackDown. Roman Reigns wants his tribe back, so he needs help doing that. And... Cody, to maintain his belt, he needs to make sure that the guys stay off, the bloodline stays off his back. So he's hoping that Roman can help him out. So you guys need to check this out. This is one of the fine examples of um, where we're at in storytelling today. I'm not going to play this whole thing, but you guys can check this out real quick. You see the ground you stand on? Everything you put your eyes on in here, it's mine. Years ago, I shed blood, sweat, and tears on this field. Many times. So that means this is my field. And if this is my field, that means this is my stadium. And if this is my stadium, you better believe this is my city. What have you done for my city? Seven cars. Subtle. Your stadium. You know what's on the other side of the stadium? Right over there? What's that? Techwood Studios. Down the street. Mm -hmm. Center stage. Just that away. What we used to call the Omni, now State Farm Arena. Multiple generations of my family have bled for the city and in the city. You played football here. Thank you. And then you went back to the beach. This is your field. But this is my home. Boom. I'm gonna leave it there. How about that? This is your feel, but this is my home. Man, I mean, that's what I'm talking about. They're, they're hitting on all cylinders right now. And I am telling you guys, all the people out there that, have, that thought that it was over for WWE, check them out again. You got to do it because you'd be doing yourself a disservice. All their programs, even Raw right now, who's not on their best of, of the top programs, has still got some, some key moments in there for sure, you know. I'm looking forward to seeing guys like L.A. Knight, Braun Breaker, Damian Priest, Hammerstone, uh, Gunter, Rhea Ripley, Bronson Reed, and my boy Austin Theory. And you guys, these are these are talents that we're going to be talking about for years to come. I, I, I know it. And I've only mentioned a few. There's many, many more, uh, especially up-and-comers in NXT. Yeah, you know, I mentioned Hammerstone. He's one of them. I hope he's still. Well, I haven't heard in a while. I hope he's still coming up through it. But he may. It may be a. Maybe over. I don't know. But uh, yeah. So if you guys made it this far, I appreciate it so much. Please hit the subscribe button and give us a like before you take off. And remember, as always, be excellent to each other. And I'll see you on the flip side. Peace out.